Hurricanes have a terrible reputation for leaving disastrous results. Is there any way to keep this from happening? Could they be steered away from populated areas or weakened so they don't do so much damage? Hi, I'm Vicki Cobb and my book, How Could We Harness a Hurricane, tackles these questions. Well, a heat engine to begin with is an engine for converting one kind of energy, namely heat energy, into a different kind of energy. In the case of hurricanes, wind energy. Heat is coming into the engine from the ocean. That's the source of heat for the hurricane. It's coming in at a fairly high temperature. So how about taking some of that heat away by cooling the surface of the ocean? Maybe drag down an iceberg from the poles or make a low-hanging cloud with an aerosol spray. As it turns out, there's a source of cold water 100 meters below the surface. Dr. Alan Bloomberg has figured out a pump where gentle wave motion brings that water up. So here's my ocean inside this tube, right. filled with water, and I made one of my, my, my pumps, and I said, if, if I push down, and I'd like you to do it, if I push this up and down, does water really come up and fall off the top? Right? So gentle motion does it. Just gentle ocean waves moving it and brings water from down below up to the top. Could we really do it? Should we really do it? Don't miss How Could We Harness a Hurricane by Vicki Cobb, illustrated by Theo Cobb.